Some 125 villages that are home to over 5,000 families in eight districts of Savannah Cape province have been hit by flooding and local authorities are calling for the urgent provisions of drinking water, rice and other essentials. The situation was reported at a meeting of the National Disaster Management Committee held in Vientiane on Tuesday, chaired by Deputy Prime Minister and Minister of Planning and Investment. Dr. San Sai Si Pandon, deputy ministers and other officials were also present. <laughs> deputy Governor of Savannah Cape Province, Mr. Ton Keo Putakanyala, told the meeting by video link that the eight districts had been hit by two storms since October 6 and that 125 villages with 5,133 families, more than 29,000 people were affected by flooding. The districts named as Sepon, Nong, Vilabuli, Pin, Champon, Sunabuli, Songkhon, and Tapang Tong. Flood waters are still rising, especially in Sunabuli, Champon, and Songkhon districts. Over 1,000 families in 41 villages have moved to higher ground, and almost 24,000 hectares of paddy fields are underwater, Mr. Tonkeo said. Roads have also been affected and over 90 cattle, pigs and other livestock were reported missing or dead. People in many places have developed diarrhea and skin ailments. Savannah Kate authorities are now assessing the damage done to houses, farmland and irrigation systems. Villagers are in need of basic supplies such as drinking water and rice. Provincial authorities are doing what they can to get essential supplies to villagers but although flood hit communities have received some assistance from local authorities and donors, many families still need health with health care, hygiene and sanitation, and the provision of general consumers items, according to a provincial official. Dr. Son Sai, who is chairman of the National Disaster Management Committee, advised the committee to speed up the provision of assistance. People living alongside main rivers have been alerted to the possibility of flooding following further rainfall in the central provinces, especially in Savannah Kid and Kamuan, with people in low-lying areas also advised to be prepared for floods. More rain is expected across many parts of the country and everyone is advised to monitor the news and weather forecasts for updates. <laughs>